Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel, The Kassan Edit, where I share all things fashion, beauty, and lifestyle, my way of course. Today I am going to do a Feed Noel by Target collection. Try on and review the overall collection and let you know what I think of everything. Now I know all the girlies are out here doing hauls. However, I am here to do this haul for a few reasons. One, if you have breasts that defy gravity after breastfeeding or you just have that issue overall, this is for you because you're going to see how this works for your breasts and what kind of support you're gonna get from that. Two, if you're a tall girl, 5'7 and up, you'll find out if this line is actually tall girl friendly. The next thing is sizing. We all wanna know what size to wear. I'm going to go through and let you know what sizes I actually got in these pieces and you will have a good idea as to what size you yourself should get. Granted, the collection launched a little over a week ago. However, when pieces start to trickle in from returns or things start to trickle in and get restocked online, you, my friend, will be ready because you will know what sizes and you will know how these things actually fit. So without further ado, let's get into it. I should let you know, I got more than a few pieces from this line because I was completely obsessed. Everything was amazing. And as you're going to see, when I try things on for you to show how they fit, you're going to see just how amazing this line actually is. The first piece I'm throwing on for you guys is this top that is very signature Fino Well. It has this hanging tie across the waist and then this cuff sleeve. The traditional pieces have a little bit more volume, but this is volume enough. I love it. And this is actually a piece that I got unexpectedly. This was not on my list to purchase, but when I saw folks wearing it right before the launch, I was kind of like, hmm, this looks good. So I went ahead and tried it on when I saw it and it was an immediate yes. I paired this with my high-waisted denim and just look how good this looks. I love me a crop top with a high-waisted number. It just gives all the vibes. And this is a very chill look. I could wear this to brunch. Um, now, this is a size 8. And I'm usually probably like a 6. I could have worn a 6 probably. But this was a little tight. This has a bit more structure to it. And there's not much stretch. So you see I do have a little bit more capping, which... I could stand to get uh, taken in by a seamstress. So, but it's, I mean, it's not the end of the world. It fits really well. The material is very lightweight, perfect for the summer season that is going to be upon us very, very shortly. All right, on to the next. Here we are with the next two pieces. It's giving Aladdin. And I am very much into both of these. These pants were also an unexpected piece because I didn't like how it fit the model. And because I'm a little on the taller side, I'm on the shorter tall side. So tall starts at 5'7", I'm right at 5'7", which is enough to make a difference when you're shopping for clothes. So I did not want these to hit shorter than my ankle. So I got these in a size 14 so that they can hit my ankle. And not only that, so we can have all this volume here. Now, I can probably get it taken in just a tad, just a tad, enough so it really, really sits well right on my waist. But look what it's giving everywhere else. Look at that. And it's not really fitting any of the models like that. However, traditional Fino Well pieces, if you know her pieces, it's all about volume. It's all about just giving more and more. For me, this line is bigger, better. That's the model for me. So I went big on these and I am so disappointed that I was unable to get the black pair, but 
I'm still gonna be on a hunt for it. And I may even just grab it on a reseller site because that's how much I love these. The material is extremely lightweight. It's the perfect resort wear because you could throw it on over a bathing suit like this. And you're not gonna feel like you're sweating. You're still going to feel very eerie and light in this. So these are a yes, yes, yes. You must get these if you don't see. I mean, look at that. Look at how this looks on the side. And let me tell you, if you do not size up, these are not gonna look like this on you. This is the look that I want to go for because again, this is what traditional Fino Well looks like. So that's what I wanna give when I'm wearing it, even if it's a collaboration piece that's not traditional Fino Well. You see what I mean? I hope you guys get what I'm saying. All right, now onto this bathing suit up top. So when I came in with the intro, I said, if you have breasts that defy gravity, find out if this line is for you and it's an immediate yes. Why? I do not have any support on with this. It's a bathing suit, you're not supposed to. And that's usually my problem when I wear bathing suits. I don't have the support to hold up my boobs because bathing suits just come most of the time without any padding or just plain Jane and your boobs are just hanging. And if you don't have the support that you need, it's not gonna look right, but guess what? These look amazing. I'm gonna come closer so you could really see. It has padding. Every single swimwear piece that I got has that support. It has the padding. And it just feels like it fits perfectly and holds you right. I feel like I don't need to worry about my boobs sagging from breastfeeding or anything like that. I feel like I'm still looking put together in this bathing suit. And that's what I love. I am wearing a size medium. The cutouts are perfect. The sleeves are nice and billowy. Um, there's a nice tight grip here on the shoulder so it doesn't feel like it's gonna fall off of your shoulder so I actually just pull them down a little bit and they're staying put so this is just I am very very proud of Fee and I do have to tell you guys a little story about Fee once I'm done with this entire try on but what do you guys give this the pants I mean, I can even wear these together. Ugh, I need these pants because I could have worn the black ones with the first shirt that I showed you guys. Ugh, and that's the other thing I love about this line. You can wear all these separates interchangeably with one another. Another swim piece. You guys are getting my untoned legs. I must love y'all because I'm still working on them. But this fits. This is my favorite swimsuit out of all the swimsuits I got from the line. This is my favorite one and I'll tell you why. Again, the support, it's there. The straps are adjustable, so if you wanna pull these girlies up, you could pull them up. Then these tassels here can pull so that you can make this a higher leg or you can make it a lower leg, or you can, sorry, or you can make it a lower leg, depending on what you're comfortable with. Because I'm hippie, the higher leg looks better and it's more flattering on my body type. So this is for every body type, every body type. And it looks so good and it just hugs you. It hugs you. And it just feels so, so good. And let's not forget how good orange looks on black women. So this is gonna be a piece that I wear to death. You could wear it as a bodysuit or a swimsuit, and I plan to do just that. It fits so, so good. I'm tempted to even get another one. I got this in a size medium, and I would just get another one just for backup because I love it that much. I don't know what would happen to this, but just in case, and I do believe this is still available online. I feel like I saw this yesterday when I was debating on whether or not I should get another one, which I probably will. So. Get this if you don't have it already. Now this next piece is one that I had to grab online after the fact because I did not see it in store. I really, really loved the print. I think this is the nutmeg. I think it is the nutmeg and I didn't look it up but it's a signature thing within the Fino L line. 
Um, and I really just loved the colors. I love the pop of color. Now this swimsuit does not have as much support in the breast area as the others do because it has this opening here on the side. So if I wanted to have a little bit more support, I would need to size down, but I can't do that because it wouldn't fit on the bottom. So I would have to keep it like this and I think I'd probably just sew it like this to give me a little bit more support. So just a note for y'all. It's not horrible, but it's definitely a little bigger on top only because of that opening there on the side. But again, it feels really comfortable. It's a bright pop of color that will look good on all hues and it's just everything y'all. Love, love, love. I'm glad I went ahead and got this. I do believe this is also still available online. I went ahead and threw on this skirt, which is partly the reason why I also got this bathing suit because I wanted to have this as a cord. I am a cord fan. Any set, give it to me. Give me all the sets because I'm here for them. And it makes getting dressed so, so easy. Imagine going on vacation and you have all these things to change into. There is a traditional Fina Well pair of shorts that I loved ever since they came out. I did not get them. I actually should, but this fits just like the shorts. You just can't, and the shorts look like they're a skirt, so they look just like this, except this is actually a skirt, and I'm loving it. I turned down my lighting a little bit so that you guys can get the true color of the pieces. They are just phenomenal. I could wear this to play tennis on vacation. Can't you see that? Put a pair of sneakers on, a visor. Ugh, come on. How good is this? Let me show you another Almost side. forgot to show you guys this cover up. I love this, you guys. I do not own many cover ups, so this was definitely something that I had my eye on. And here's why I love. Look how it tapers to my body. How many cover-ups do you know do that? How many? And the price was just right. The price was right on this one. This, I would say size all the way down on this. This is an extra small. I am by nobody's standards an extra small, but that's what I'm wearing in this. If I wanted to, I could, if I wanted to, sorry, I could have even sized down even further to an extra, extra small, but I just want to be comfortable and the material is very very stretchy that's why i'm able to size down so much you see all that hugs all the right places just everything that you need for vacation makes the ease of getting dressed seamless and i just threw it on over that last bathing suit and it's perfect Beach bag, hat, some sandals, you're good to go for the day. Make sure you wear your sunscreen. That's it. We've got the next set. And how do you like? I absolutely love this. I forgot to tell you guys what size I have on in this skirt. I'm wearing a size 10. It fits me perfectly on my waist. And again, it's giving me the volume that I want. But it just fits as if it was made for me, guys. I do have hips and a booty and this fits perfectly so I would not have wanted to size down any further or up this is perfect because I want it to fit high-waisted now this crop top is a size small it's smocked in the back so it has all that extra stretch that you need but also it's giving me support and you can also tie it at the shoulders at whatever length that you want it to be so it'll give you all the support depending on how you tie it i'm not wearing a bra just for reference so that you know and it fits fine if it's just fine and if i were on vacation i'd probably not want to wear a bra just so i could feel comfortable if i'm by a beach or whatnot this is another favorite because again i love sex now we have moved into the rich auntie zone Okay, this is what we're getting right now. 
This is also the part of the video where we address the tall girls. All right, now these pants, y'all know how I do not like high waters. I, I despise them. I just, I just do. I'm on my tippy toes and this is how this fits me. What size am I wearing? I'm wearing a double X. I had to. When I wore the next size down, which is the extra large, my hips and this crotch area were doing something funny. So I had to size up in order to eliminate that weird situation that was happening there. If you have hips, you're gonna run into that issue. So size up, it won't be a big deal. I will have to get it nipped at the waist, just a tad, so it could stay up on me, and that's it. And that's because I want it a little high-waisted if I didn't care about it being right on my waist or below. I wouldn't even need to do a thing. Um, I will show you when I switch out to the shirt how it looks when it's sitting lower on my waist. So I'm very, very happy with this size. I am wearing a medium in the swim top. I got this at the next store that we went to if you saw my last video. I got a small and a, no. Yeah, I got a small and a medium. The medium is what fit best. I could have gone up to a large, just so the cups could hold my breast better because I feel like I have a little bit of spillage underneath here. So I would have gone up to a large. I might still look out for that. The robe is a 1X. I tried on just about every size. I went from a large all the way up to a 1X, and the 1X is what was giving this oversized look that I was looking for. And can you even tell that this is a 1X? No. And in standard size, I am probably like a medium. I'm like a small medium in tops. Um, in jackets, a size eight if we're going by numbers. Um, and this brogue fits just right. So if I had the double X L, I'd be fine, but I was more comfortable, or I preferred the one X. But anything from a extra large to a one X fit fine. So the range on these sizes are okay to play with. And that's really what I wanted to make sure that I displayed when discussing the sizes and trying these on for you guys. Let me move on to the top. Okay, let's discuss. The pants are now sitting lower, right at my waist. I'm still on my tippy toes and look at what the pants are doing. Look what they're giving you guys. This was exactly the vibe I was going for. And if you're going for that vibe as well, you know what you need to do, size up, size up. I love the piping on the side of this. I love the print, very, very resort wear friendly. Now this top, I also got in a 1X, cause you know why I do not like short arms. Um, I actually probably would be okay going even higher with this. So what's after this? Is it a 2X? I don't know what's after this, but I'd be fine going up another size just so I can get more length, but it's not even that serious because it looks like the shirt is cut that way because I went up considerably. So this must just be how the shirt is cut. Beautiful. I could tie it up at the waist, which I haven't showed you guys. I'll probably show you next just so you could see but i'm sure you guys have seen all the ways that you could wear this this could be a pajama set on vacation it could be a going to breakfast if you're at an all-inclusive and you just want to throw something on real quick that's effortless and you just want to stride into breakfast looking like the rich auntie that you are this is it this is it y'all last but certainly not least <gasps> How dare I? There's another piece. We'll get there. Alrighty. How do we love? We love, right? Look how the pants fit. Same size. This is basically the same, not basically, this is the same set 
as the last one that I put on is just in another print. Same exact thing. So I'm wearing a double X in the pants, double XL in the pants, and a double XL in the top too, because I was only able to find this in stores and they did not have the one X at the store that I went to and it was not available online. This is one of the first things that I had in my cart when I attempted to purchase online and it sold out, as we all know. So this just goes to show you that you can really play with all the sizes. The last shirt was a 1X, this here is a double XL. Still not an issue, but you see how I just didn't need to be afraid to size up? So don't be afraid to do so. And I would not know that had I not tried on in the store. And this is why I'm doing this video for those of you who did not have the opportunity to try on in store. So this is kind of like your try on guide. And it looks great. The moment we've been waiting for. The moment. What's, what's not to love? What is not to love? about this oh my goodness if you guys did not watch my previous video go back watch it so you could get the story on how I got this but basically my girlfriend from California casually came across this and bought it for me and Sharpra and I am wearing a double XL in this a double XL and this is very, very signature Fino well, which is exactly why it flew off the shelves because she is known for these type of designs with her robes. She always has these beautiful robes within her line that has just like these exquisite vibes to them. And we got a piece of that in her Target collection. I mean, can you believe it? This was 35 bucks. For 35 bucks, we got signature phenol oil. I'm gagging. I'm gagging. I have plans for this. No time soon, but I have plans for this. Just know this is going everywhere with me when I travel. And I am wearing just a regular bra. I'd probably wear a, uh, what do you call it? A swim top underneath. And because I need support with my boobies, I'd probably maybe pin it like this or some boob tape and that's it oh just I could picture myself sashaying on somebody's beautiful grounds on vacation yes that is it for the try on I really hope this was helpful to any of you who were looking to get help with sizing fit and all of the above because I know those are the things that I would look for. So if you have any further questions, be sure to just hit me up in the comments. I will definitely respond back. Until then, get ready for the next video. By the way, we're on a resort streak because my next video should be in H&M Hall. And let me tell y'all, between this collection and H&M's resort 2023, or summer, spring, summer 2023, Y'all not ready. Y'all not ready. But if you keep up with me here, subscribe and hit the bell notification so that you do not miss what's coming up so you know how to look for this upcoming summer, just make sure you do all the things. Bye, y'all.